Boys, the Church of Kendo is in session. On screen, you can see I just exfilled with two, not one, but two vintage wine bottles, and it was super easy, and I'm going to show you the easiest way and easiest trick possible, so let's get into it. As I always say, if this video was informative at all and you guys like DMZ content and me, subscribe to the channel and hit that post notification bell. Let's shoot for 25 likes on this video and let's get into it. So I'm going to show you all three dead drop locations, but there's only one I really want you to go to and that's in the one in Al Masra City, but I'll just show you. So there's right here where is the junkyard location if you guys are new here and you have wine bottles that you want to, you know, throw in. The other location right here, as you can see on the map, is right above the train tracks near the cemetery. Pretty simple. The one that I actually want you to go to though and and trust me, it's the best one is in Almazra City. So on screen right now, you're going to see me looting these two specific spots in Almazra City. I'm showing you on the mini map right now. It's Burger Town, but as Hasbulla would say, it'd be Burger. And then the other one is like another place called Yum Yum. And the vintage wine bottles and the wine bottles are right here. Look, look at that. Two vintage wine bottles right there. Literally, all I did was open up these little fridges. All these little fridges and containers have wine bottles and or purified water or tea. And this is so easy because you also get the aged wine in here as well, as well as the vintage. And as you can see, it literally just has delivered 20 wine bottles. And there's a bunch of cheap wine bottles here too. So now we're going to go to Yum Yum. Look at Yum Yum. Look at all these little fridges I'm opening and all these little containers I'm opening. I'm literally just doing it over and over again, over and over again. Nelly, you know what I'm saying, guys? No, you don't. Anyway, so if you look and you can find, no joke, six to seven wine bottles in one place. I ended up getting this done in four missions because I ended up getting really lucky. The only thing that was a little hard was the extracting three vintage wine bottles. But as you can see, I open up Yum Yum and in Yum Yum as well, there's seven or eight different areas that I can loot. So all in all, you're opening up about 16 to 17 miniature containers and each one on average will have at least one cheap wine and the other ones will have at least Every other to every three will have an aged wine. I got really lucky and I ended up getting, it's just a bench, like really it's all just luck and loot drops, but this is as you can see where I'm going. Um, but yeah, after I do all of these, I end up going to the drop zone location, which I showed you already for this one, but that's all I really have to say. Like this is the easiest one possible to do. And the reason why I did this one is because you only have to do five of the six missions to get the final mission to go into tier four. And I'm not finding $200,000 worth of cash. This is a lot easier. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, tell me if you guys in the comment section below like this method. I'm just showing you the easiest place to get them, which is Burger Town and any place that sells food or drink. So like I said, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Tell me if you guys in the comment section below had a trouble doing this for tier three missions. I love you guys and out. Peace.